Hey, what's going on everyone? This is Ari Views back with another video and today I will show you guys my top 10 most useful iOS 14 home screen widgets. Of course, there are a lot of iOS 14 home screen widgets. Some of them are really cool. Some of them will make the setup of your device look really, really awesome. But there are of course other ones that are very, very useful. So in this video, I'll try to pick some of the best widgets that also are very useful. Of course, if you have any suggestions for a widget that you think it's really useful make sure you comment down below so let's get started with the first one kicking things off with speedboard now speedboard is an app that lets you have your favorite contacts on the home screen of your ios 14 device now the cool thing about this app is that you can choose which actions you want to perform by using the shortcuts that are on these widgets so here i have the contacts we have two different sizes medium and the large one and of course on the large one you will be able to add way more contacts and add different actions so you will notice they have an icon whether you have chosen facetime imessage or the phone call and of course you just tap the contact from the widget and it will redirect you to the action that you choose really really cool and of course very useful and it also displays here the pictures of the contacts which is really awesome now if we jump to the app you can see right here you can go ahead and edit the contacts you can add more contacts here and of course you can also remove ones that you want to remove and once you have added the contact you can also choose which action you want to perform send a message make a facetime call or a phone call now right here at the bottom you will have medium and large these are the home screen widgets now from here here you can pick which contacts you want to see on which widget so you don't have to have the same contacts on both of the widgets you can just go ahead and uncheck this if you want to remove one and of course check it if you want to add it to the widget on the home screen next up we have t widget by far one of my favorite widgets that has recently been released on the app store now it's a shame that twitter doesn't have its own home screen widgets but of course with t widget you can get these awesome widgets on the home screen of your ios 14 device where it will display the twitter feed of course of your account so right here we have on the larger one three latest tweets and then we have here a medium one which shows you the latest tweet now of course you can go ahead and tap right there and it will redirect you to that tweet in which you tap really really cool and of course you will need to go ahead and log in with your twitter account into this app and then you will get your twitter feed right on the home screen of your device next up is widget link now every time you need to quickly access a link from the home screen of your ios 14 device widget link will do that for you it's just like a bookmark on the home screen of your ios 14 device so here we have two different sizes we have the medium one and the smaller one of course on the medium you can add way more links on the smaller one you have just one link you tap on it and it will redirect you to that website you can see here the medium one it also redirects you to which one you tap so you tap on google right there in this case and apple it just redirects you right there now if you go into the app you will notice here you will have the option to go ahead and add links and of course remove ones that you already have so you tap right there to add a new link it's very simple to use you go ahead add the link click add right there and of course create a title and you're good to go now here we'll also see an image you can go ahead and change that it will automatically add like the image of the website but you can change that to any image that you like i have added this widget on a previous video as well but i had to include it because it's very very useful and i know a lot of people use gmail on their device this is the gmail widget it offers only one but it's really useful you will have three different actions that you can perform from here you want to search your email you tap right there at the top of the widget and it will take you directly to the search section you want to compose an email tap right there quickly go to the compose or you want to show the unread messages you go ahead and of course just tap right there and it shows you the unread messages that you have on your account really really cool and of course very useful i know a lot of people use the gmail app for their gmail account or other accounts as well because of course you can log in with other emails into the app as well so this will be very very useful for you to quickly access search compose or your unread messages and the best thing is that if you have multiple accounts into your gmail app you can just go ahead three details the widget and from here tap on the edit section and go ahead and choose which account you want to use with the widget that of course is really awesome next up we have money coach now with money coach you will be able to track your budget your spendings and your upcoming bills 
so it offers a ton of different widgets for a ton of different actions and of course info as well so here i have two of them we have a medium one which basically shows you your next goal what you want to save for and of course it tracks how much you have saved and how much you have left and right here we have a larger one which is really cool which shows you the upcoming bills so if you have bills to pay and you have set them up on the app you of course go ahead and create a bill and add the date when you have to pay that then of course it displays right here it shows you the bill and how many days and hours you have left until you have to pay that bill really awesome and of course very very useful next up we have x progress and with x progress you can track different things on the home screen of your ios 14 device so here we have two different widgets we have the larger one which shows you right there it's tracking of course the percentage of the year you can change that to any event you want and then right here will show you your two most recent events and of course will display how many days are left until the event as well we have a medium one which also just displays one of the progress that you're tracking you can tap right there to go ahead and choose the event so here we have a custom event we can go ahead and add that and then it will display that right here on the home screen it also has a few different like themes here that you can choose from so we have a terminal one which looks really really cool and that of course will show you everything you need to know regarding the upcoming events next up is personal best now personal best is an app that will track your workout so if you like working out and all that stuff, then this is the widget for you. It will display you your latest workouts. Right here you can see on the larger widget, we have four different workouts that it will display. These being your four latest workouts. And then you have other widgets as well. It has a ton of selections from widgets with different displaying of information. So right here we have the latest workout. It will show you how many calories you have burned, the time, and of course when it did happen and what type of workout it was then here we have the latest for seven days so it basically shows you a summary of the seven days how much you have worked out of course the time right there how many times and then it will also show you how many calories you have burned during the past seven days really really cool if you like to work out and keep track of it this is the widget to go if you're a sports fan, then you need to install Sports Alerts on your iOS 14 device. With Sports Alerts, you will get the latest sports scores right on the home screen of your iOS 14 device. Now, the cool thing is that once you have set it up through the app, you choose your favorite teams and all that, you can see all the favorite sports, favorite team right on the home screen. It offers the three different sizes. The smaller one will display your favorite team which basically lets you 3D touch here, go ahead, tap on edit widget and choose the favorite team that you want to display here. And it will show you the latest scores from the games of your favorite teams. At the top right there, we'll see live scores from different sports. You can change that by just 3D touching there and the bigger one, the larger widget also does the same. You go to league here and you choose whichever league you want to see there. And of course, it will display all the latest scores from that league or that sport that you choose, which is really awesome. So every sports fan needs to have this widget on the home screen of their device. Next up, we have an app called Documents. Documents by Randall. This is a very famous app and I know a ton of people use this app to manage their files. But of course, you can do a lot more with it. And it has some really awesome home screen widgets and a ton of selection. I believe it has more than 10 different widgets that you can add to display different informations and perform different actions on the home screen of your iOS 14 device. So here we have two of them. We have one that shows the recent files, which you can access from here. So you just tap on whichever part you want and it will open that file that you have recently used, which is really, really cool. Lower here, we have actions. You can perform quick actions from the home screen. You want to see your recent files or maybe you want to go to your favorites. You tap right there and it takes you right into that section of the app, which is very useful, of course, to quickly access anything you want on this app if you use documents by Randall. And last but not least is Battery Grapher. Now, Battery Grapher is an app that will track the usage of the battery of your iPhone. What you need to do once you have installed this app is just go ahead and add the home screen widgets and leave them there because it will track 
the battery of your device it will track the hour the average loss per hour and all that stuff and display them right here so you will have to leave them on the home screen so it tracks them more accurately and it will be able to show you more information now i just have added these like a few minutes ago and it's not displaying that much information but in a few hours it will of course as it tracks the battery it will show you here the grapher of the battery then it shows you how much percentage you have lost in the last hour the average percentage lost per hour and of course the average battery life of your iphone and then of course right here it will show you how much you have left before it goes to zero percent so nine hours 25 minutes there which is of course very useful to know all that information so you don't run out of battery when you know it so battery grapher very awesome app and it offers all the three different sizes of the widgets the bigger one is the best because it will display these extra info right here which you cannot find on the two smaller ones so that is it for this video guys these are my top 10 most useful ios 14 home screen widgets i know that a lot of widgets that are useful maybe that you like but of course in my opinion these are some of the best that you can get so thank you guys for watching don't forget to leave a like if you enjoyed the video if you want to install any of these widgets of course make sure you go ahead and check out the pinned comment you will find all the links there again thank you guys for watching and i'll see you on the next one